guys, welcome back to my channel, bro. This is me on the set, and today we'll be doing, I mean, more like a revamped or the better animations than rather than I said in the video. It is kind of like the better animations, so we'll be checking up the idle animation in this video. So it's like the normal sitting animation which I've been covered in my YB in part one, and I, this is actually the more revamped version of that making animations so first you want to need you need to do is add a seat to the workspace so yeah you need to add a seat normal seat so this is it's a black object right here black rectangle type stuff and add animations plus a script so now there is the script in the link in the description down below go check the script out and then there is the normal black object if you don't want the black objects you can just increase the transparency or change the color of the object so if you increase the transparency it will just invisible it's just you seen there so if you want to import it into an like a normal couch or like a sitting animation on a chair or on like any other place you can add models on top of that add your seat so that's gonna work better. just imagine this part is a seat and the other normal stuff is I mean the other the other black thing is like the input of it like the thing that makes you sit so just imagine like that and just try to make it like what you want expecting and what you are so that as you can see you can put the transparency to one so it just becomes invisible that's it now let's try the animation part so let me import a block rig so this is the normal block dummy now we need to add animation to it so if you are adding animations make sure you got the right or the or preferable or like the most like you are good to use animators or a bunch of them in the library plugins um, right now I'm using the legacy animation editor you can also use the normal Roblox animation editor as well so if you want our correct accurate animations you can just move the dummy on that not on the normal legacy like, animation editor, okay? Not the R one. Just move it just with the or normal and normal tools on Roblox. So that's it. And now we need to create the animation just like this. Um, yeah. So as you can see the animation is done so what you want to do is the animation and make sure you set it to the priority to ideal and and the animation the looping yes make the looping yes so looping is like repeat your animation so export that to your any animations and copy that ID you probably know how to copy that ID the top one copy copy that and yeah now j let's just try test the stuff out so you can you can see that's a looping in the normal Roblox animation sure. so yeah so let's go test them out so we are going to be getting the animations if there there are some bugs on the animation make sure you lower your seed that's going to get okay that's done so as you can see the, this is the animation 
you can just bend your animation a bit over just yeah so now there is the anchor animation there are a lot of parts the like the core and stuff like that so we'll be taking a look as you can see I anchored some parts I mean just like oh I opened the anchor animation editor and just like do this and you can just anchor the name the ob thing I mean stuff or whatever an object the dummy and you get the and make sure you're in the animation editor then only this is going to work so that's actually it then there is the you go to the priority you will actually get the normal movements action actions like the punch if for example punching animation using a sword animation that's that and then there is the normal ideal and the core you don't want to mind about core then there is the and movement the movement is actually like a walking animation so if you are wanna do is like the normal core animation normal punch as well you won't move but if you're doing an action you can just do it while moving that's that so um, the vibroom part 2 video will probably come out soon so yeah and time it's going really wild the views on it um thank you so much for that guys and um, yeah really appreciate it and hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did make sure you subscribe to this